Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the World Conquest. Now on 1.2.5, and I had to re-record this episode. What happened was, is once you defeated the last king, you got to the last kingdom. They paid you a ton of money. They were going to pay me over 30 million a day to peace out, which made it impossible for me to go back to war. So there was a bug. It was fixed in one, two, five. So now that it's fixed, I can just go back to the previous episode, begin from there, so the bug doesn't hit, and we can see what it does. What we have going on here is, is this is left, and then it should just be that castle right over there, I believe. Is There's a castle there. Not sure why that's red. Over there. I believe that's the only one left. So I already know from my previous episode that my guys are absolutely going to demolish this. So I'm not going to go ahead and worry about it. Let's just go ahead and choose these. Choose these. It doesn't really matter. Because I, I don't care. All right. So they want to declare war on Valandia. And then we have the owner of Marinoth, which I don't think is me. Yeah, I didn't get it. Okay, so that's all taken care of. They want to declare war. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do about that yet. Oh, I have to actually do it. Because I can override them once. Should I override them? Um, I am not going to override. Because all I have to do is siege this. And then get to the castle and siege it instantly. And Batania is gone. I can go ahead and peace back out. But I actually want to save my influence. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to allow them to declare war. Now I'm going to go ahead and I am going to take care of this battle right here. That's fine that they want to declare war. I wish I would have waited actually to do it. But like I said, we're going to absolutely demolish them. They have no siege equipment. We have one up. We have two up right now. So let me get this battle done. And then we can get to that last castle and worry about our final objective. Okay, that's done. And as I said, I knew I would utterly destroy them from my last recording. So that's why I wasn't worried about it. And we'll send these troops. And then there are two things that I need to mention. As soon as I can once find, find my legionaries. There we go. Okay. So the first thing that we're going to deal with is we are on day 997. I forgot to mention that. Now, we still got 200 days to go. Yeah, a lot of people hate me for that one. The other thing is that what they did was is they changed defenses now. Um, first of all, they're going to have, you can see there's 11 in the garrison, 320 in the militia from a town you just took. That is actually a new thing in the game based, I believe, on the population. You're going to have militia instantly when we walk out of here. They're going to be easily defendable. Uh, which is a lot different than you normally having virtually nothing. So that is really, really awesome that they did that. I'm so happy they did that. All right, with this done now, so the only thing that we need to do now is take that castle. But what I need to do is I need to get rid of people. We've got this war going on. And so now we need to start getting rid of some people. It is my great honor to introduce myself to you. She's actually good though, but I Ah oh, Let's start kicking some people. See, a lot of these people I think are the, are good. Mm. I think Apis is one that we can't have. I can't click on him. I'm yours to command. Allow me to Yeah, he's got negative mercy. We need to get rid of him. All 
All right, that'll still leave me 1,100 defenders. And I have a feeling some of these others are as well. I'm yours to command. No, he, Oven's good. We can keep him. What I'm doing is, is anybody with negative mercy, if they're negative and you show mercy after taking a feat, you lose relation. So, Doran I can keep. Negative honor and valor. All right, so the bottom three are good. So we just have this guy. All right, they're all good. Which I'm fine with that. So the only thing we have to do is take that castle and they're gone. Now, I'm waiting to see if they're going to siege down here, because that's actually what happened in my last game. Oh, I got too many troops. Whoa. Whoopsie. That wouldn't have been good. All right. We just have to get over here and build really quick. And it's over with. They'll be gone. So let's rush right on over there. I'm waiting to see if they are going to siege like in my last one. Ooh, level up. You're going to take party size. That's all we need to do. They got 240, which is an easy victory. They're actually coming over here to help me. That's why I want to get rid of them as quick as possible which i don't think they're gonna get it built before me i think i'm gonna build this and it's gonna be a simple battle um rts did get broken 1.2.5 so as of the time of this recording it's broke so from here we're gonna get done with this battle and then batania is gone so let me get done with this battle and then we can finish off batania and all we'll have left are the landing. Okay, there are six guys left, and I have a feeling that they might be um, bugged out because I'm losing a couple guys. So let's just go ahead and send our troops. We didn't lose anybody. They did change how sim defenses are. Defenders used to have a two to two and a half KDR. So we're going to see how that changes. And they are going after that castle. And I don't think I can make it down there in time. But now, they're gone. And actually, uh, let's see. Now, they are going to be running around, but we'll see how much. And goodbye. We now have one kingdom left. And we're about day 1,000. How many does this have? It's got 54 militia. So we'll manage the cat. Oh, wow. Holy cow. Okay, well, this is going to be a little bit of a problem. Because as soon as I leave, they're only going to get plus three. And the militia won't fight until there's at least 25. So I have a feeling that I, although there's all this stuff to build. You know, I'm not going to build it. With me leaving, it'll still get a plus six. That means in three days, it'll be ready to go. So I'm going to end up leaving this. We now, that's it. All we have left is Batania or Valandia. This, I, like I said, I don't know if I'm going to make it down there in time. Now that Valandia is done, there's really only one objective. And that's just take as many of their prisoners as possible. I believe all of those are sturgeon. So we'll give it away to him. Mm, now, I don't know if I can make it there in time. I do have... I do have better time, and that's why I'm coming down here. 
there's a 1500 man army they are probably going to go after Marinoth which is going to take them a while to siege Marinoth I'm hoping I can make it down there and take them prisoner I'm making 15,000 a day now uh, let's get this dealt with the castle you willow bark surgeon as well. Somebody just died in battle. I didn't see who that was. Embers. Okay. Can we get down here? I'm hoping we can get down there before they siege. It's going to take them a while. Wherever they're going to siege, our guys are going to siege that. Please let me stop them. I'm hoping I can stop them. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, they just took it. But, but, do I siege this? They only have 48 militia. That's a lot of lords. Do I, a siege defense offense, I almost would rather have them come out of town and attack them. I'm going to see if I can get them to drop out of town. All right, they came out. And we're just as fast. And I can't tell if we're faster. We got 0.8 in prisoners. I can take seven. I gotta get rid of five now. We'll get rid of. I don't want to get rid of horses. So we'll get rid of those. Now the question is can I catch them? I should be able to do if we hit grass. I got them. Yes. So we get a nice big battle out of this 1200 versus 1000. I don't think they're going to come after us. Now remember, sadly, we do not have RTS. So I'm already going to start moving. Because I have a feeling they're going for that. You better go. Go there. There. Our archer is actually good. I like the way I have my calves set up. My calves are awful close. Yeah, they're aiming for me. Yeah, I wish I had RTS. That got broke. I mean, we are getting kills. But I think they are going more after those horse archers. They got quite a bit of cav. But, so do I. I need to get my cav in position. My cav are newly in position. See, this is not how I want them. I need to be further over. That'll, that should be better. We'll just have to wait for them to come in. Alright, because so here come their cab.
hate the Zag. Oh, they're coming in. Got him. And you. We'll just go at it with the act. Gotta get that horse out of the way. I'm sure the archers are probably gunning for me. I got knocked off my horse. We gotta get our archers up here. I think it's a tactical retreat they're doing right now. guys forward clean up the little mess we have right here and what's really cool is then that is going to take out about eight of their lords because I actually have to save up influence to override my vassals if they want to peace out. That's going to be my biggest problem. Because once we start getting the prisoners, we do not want to peace out under any circumstance. And of course, I don't have reinforcements. I'm so far away. Starting to do enough damage that I'm breaking axes or steels really well. Bye. See ya. Uh, that horse out of here. Off we go. Got you both. Double shot. All right. That is uh, about it. I got 37 of them. Yeah, it went well. But what that means now is... Prisoner, 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 prisoner. Okay. Um, I actually don't want any prisoners. Because I'd like to go run down south now. Wow, oh, that's a 50. There you go. Nice upgrade for you. Okay. Um, they're going after that castle as well. We're going to be like all over the place at first. 
and it's not going to look good. We're going to look like we're losing, but I'm, um, I'm doing this. It's a tactical thing. You will see when I do it, zoom. Um, I'll take the minus projectile damage. And she is going to get, uh, might as well give her control. Maybe she'll get close to 275. Okay, so now here is another problem. I need prison. I got to run through these guys and take prisoners. And that was it. Two guys got prisoners. So now I should have all of them. None of my guys got them. All right. That is way down there. So let's now head down there. Wait a minute. They are going after Marino. I think I would rather go after this big army. Yeah, they're already sieging. We want to get over there. How many they got in here? Uh, this is actually going to be close. Why can't I tar- I hate how I can't target. I don't know if we're going to make it there in time. It's going to be close. Uh, no, we're going to make it. They're going to go first. I can take- Why does that keep going- Oh, because I- did it, Why am I going five seven five twelve? All right, so we are, okay, we took the castle. We'll give it to you. And then we will do this battle to get all these lords. Thank you very much. We need to move these guys. Because I don't care if I lose a couple beasts along the way. I can easily just take them back. Really, though, the most important thing, without a doubt, is capture as many as you can. Can't hear if I'm even hitting them. There we go. It was actually a mount. I think they're coming in. They are coming in. I want them to go melee. So all I'm trying to do is get rid of their cab. Once their cab are done, they're finished. I keep telling you that it's, it's the key to winning victories. Winning vic, winning vic. Why does that sound not right? The, the key to really winning is getting rid of their cab. Yeah, archers suck and all that, but uh, really, it's it, it's their cab. Boy, he almost got me. I need to get these guys in position. Yeah, the problem is they're up over this hill. I have my charge. I go up, look at the top, and see how good we were doing. I think they're doing another tactical retreat by the looks of it. Okay, this one's taken care of. I got 11 kills out of it. I'm happy with that. But more importantly, the prisoners.
That's all that matters. Collecting as many as I can as fast as I can. Because as soon as we take most of their lords prisoner, then we're free to steamroll them. Now let's hope I can get them. There are some I might not be able to get because we've already traded. I don't know how often it resets. See, I traded. With, I thought I traded with him. Yeah, it hasn't, it hasn't battered long enough. Okay, so there's two there, and then there are four here. Time and at your. Well, they should be happy now they're getting money. I'm your do you have any? Yes, you do. You have one? Wait, did everybody get one? Feed for you. Yeah, it looks like everybody got one. There should be one more on the last guy. Oh, no, that's it. Prisoners plus one. Who did I miss? Okay, I missed you. Alright. So the only one that's left is this guy. Who I can't get him from. So I don't want to go into a town right now. But that's all we're doing. Is we're just watching to where they're sieging. And that's where we're heading to. We're just taking prisoners. I gotta wait to go into town. Until I get that done. And I got to watch this ever so closely because I need to know the instantly. See, it's not been long enough. I need to know instantly when I can. I could go take those castles back. Now, it's the new system. So they actually have more in the feast. Come on. I want your prisoners. 150. Projectile deflection. 284. These are... These are... Uh, that's only got 121 defenders. Got him. And I got both. And I got troops. Nice. Because they captured the caravan. Six. Why does it cost so much? I thought it was four. Okay, can I do this yet? Wait a minute. Did they both escape? That was him. He doesn't have prisoners. I don't know where they went. Oh, why is it? Hmm. 531 out of 512. Oh, let's see. We got to give some away. You won't have nine. I don't think you have any. Yeah, I don't know what happened to us, those guys. There we go. I think they escaped because it would have said, can I talk to one of your prisoners? That's why I think both of them escaped. Probably because he was overfilled on prisoners. So now what do we want to go after? Um, 
I mean, I could go after that castle, but I kind of want to take this one back in hopes that this is so close to Blandian territory that they keep coming after it. So I'm actually going to try to take this back. I want the AI to come back after this. Which, we're going to get this built before they can. So once again, it's going to be a, a little quick. I'm not going to sim it. You know, maybe I should test out a sim. Um, I Actually, I think before I test out a sim, I'm going to want to... I think I'm definitely going to want to test it out first. So I, I'm going to let this play out. Just because it's going to be virtually nothing. And I don't want to take a chance on a sim battle. Because I don't like sim battles. So I'm just going to let this run. And I'll get back to you guys when it's done. And that one is done. Uh, I did lose 21. That was a lot. They only had 159. So, I, I mean, 35 total. I don't know how the sim would have went. And like I said, I don't want prisoners. Now, this beef is... How much is this going to start out with? 50 troops. About 48 militia. Get this done. Never tires out. Always shooting at targets. Social, fine. Manage. Hmm. Honestly... I don't think it needs anything. Now the hope is the AI will come after that. I'd actually like to push them out of here if possible. I should think about coming around and taking this because my guys are taking that. That'll push them back to here. And I think I can probably get away with that. I think I can. Or they would siege something. They, I think they're going to probably siege that. I'm not going to worry about taking a second one. Yeah, they only got 145 defenders. I can take this in another quick battle. Ortizia? That's a different story. They're going to have over 600 defenders. So let's hurry up and take this. And then from here, we're going to go to Ortizia. We're going to take Ortizia. Legate Ortesia Legata, and then we'll have them out of our territory. So, and I'm building up my influence so I can override my vassals. All right, let me get this battle done, and then we'll see where we sit at. Battle done, only lost 19. No prisoners, we're saving room. Okay, that's taken. Manage. They're building a granary. Uh, yeah, I think I'll stick with the granary. One day. Then to train militia. Because that'll bump that food up to 350, I believe. Uh, four, uh, yeah, 350. I'll live with that. Alright, so that's taken care of. Any, anybody in the dungeon? Nobody in the dungeon. Okay, we got two more taken. Uh, any sieging going on? The AI is not sieging us. I was looking for them to siege, which gives me the opportunity to go for Ortesia and Legata. The question is, do I want to break the walls? If I break the walls, I won't take hardly any loss. Well, very few loss. It'll take a long time to break the walls. And I think they'll be more likely to come after these beasts than to come after Artesia. But I want to get them out of my area. See, right now, they don't have anybody in there. You can see that it's, it's just 635. So if I... That guy is independent. He'll be gone soon. We took another castle. So I think I want to get up here. And I want to take... Um, now the question becomes, do I break the walls? 
which I kind of want to do. And I want to have a ram. Oh my word, look at how instant that was. Uh, I'm guessing that's a bug in the code. This might actually not be good. I should have stopped and went over and grabbed them. That's uh, two guys right there. That was instantaneous almost. Yikes. Are they going to be able to do that from now on? I'm a little worried about that. That's a pretty bad bug if it is. Wow. All right, they are sieging. Okay, so they're going after that castle, which I, I think that's fine because it's probably just one guy doing it, and I'd rather have Ortizia. I want to go after them if they're doing major sieges. All right, so they're going after a second one, which is probably just, once again, a single guy. But let's see how bad this is. When we destroy, how quickly do they build? Uh, it looks like those were brought out of reserve. Oh, look at that. We go instant. Oh my word, Tail World, what are you doing? Um, some of these are almost instantly built. Okay, that's done. I'm trying to figure this out now. Now, if I just take this regularly, we would still win. I have I only have 96 morale. Do I have troops that can recruit free? No, I don't. They're all Aserai. I could take 11 troops. That would give me 11... Hundred against their six hundred, it would be a waste. I mean, we would we would demolish them, and we're going to demolish them. And I think I'm going to end up doing that. Let's take eleven, uh, one, and five, and there we go. That'll put us down right to eighty-two. That's good. So this should actually be another quick battle. And then I got to try to figure out where those guys are at. And then we're going to go back after that castle. I don't think I really need to do this battle. And there you have it. We have taken Ortizia. And. Um, I, I just don't want to. Well, there, if there's Empire, I should be grabbing them. I think I still had the presence perk. So I'd 100% want to grab Empire. I don't know. I have to double check if I do have presence. I don't know if I still have presence or leader of the masses. I probably have leader of the masses, I think. And I know I might get this one. Okay, so it has a forum left. It's only 10%. They do have an orchard and a granary. So that's actually fine. Let's get over to train militia. Keep dungeon. No prisoners. No prisoners. Um, they sold them. The AI is now selling prisoners. Wow. Oh man, this is this is crazy. I have a feeling I might need to do a beta branch update. And we want to go with Governor, Governor, Governor Sturge. Which means they most likely sold, they could sell lords. 
Mm. All right, I don't think I need to do anything here. That town is good. They are sieging that castle. You're down to 58, so we need to give you some troops. You'll take the militia. Six more. All right, there we go. And I think that's going to be it for this episode. I think we're running a little bit long right now. And so we're down to the final one. This is 1.2.5. We're going to try to push this. And then that way we'll have them cornered into here. And hopefully my armies can help out. I am saving every bit of influence I can for when they want to peace out. Paying 102000 that's going to be an issue. The other thing I could possibly do is kick some of these higher clans with a ton of influence. These empire clans right here, I don't know how much it'll cost to kick them, but I'm considering doing that as well. Because if I get rid of these four clans here, yeah, it's a lot of loss. These guys, they're not going to really be able to override my influence that much. I'm hoping. So I'm going to figure out what to do there, but that's where we're sitting at right now. I didn't see how many we actually had prisoner. 21 prisoner right now. I have them on defensive. I'm going to leave it there for now. 102,000 though. Ooh, man, that's a lot of money. But finally, we're back at it on 1.2.5. I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. And thanks for watching.